Hi, I'm Amy from the Altice store and today I'm going to go over a few different Morningstar charge controllers to show you the different features available in, in the different charge controllers. So we're going to be going through kind of the, the lower middle of the range systems to, uh, to give you an idea of what's available. The Sunsaver uh, family is available in a 6 amp, a 10 amp or a 20 amp and the 6 amp is only available in 12 volts and the 10 and 20 amp are available 12 and 24 volts. The 6 amp can handle probably about 75 watts of, of solar power but double check on the short circuit current of your panel to make sure that, that it is within the range. Um, and a nice feature with the Sun Saver is a low voltage disconnect or LVD. What that does is because it's connected to the battery and to your load, so you can have, say, your lights connected to this, it's going to be measuring the voltage of the battery bank, and it will know if those batteries get low that you don't have enough power left to power those lights. So it will automatically shut off your lights. And then once the solar charges your batteries back up, it'll turn your lights back on. Great, great feature to keep from accidentally ruining your batteries if, say, you leave and forget to turn off your lights. This does have internal temperature compensation. Batteries do charge differently based on the temperature of the battery. So because this is right near your battery, it's going to know what temperature the air is and will compensate and charge it differently based on the temperature. It does have a setting for sealed or flooded lead acid batteries. So again, based on the type of battery, it will charge it differently uh, depending on if it's if this little little connector is in or out, the wires can handle up to t uh, the the screws can handle up to 10 gauge wire. The nice thing that is also available is the sunlight. Now the sunlight is available in 10 or 20 amp, and um, it is also a so in addition to all of the other features for the sun saver, the sunlight can actually turn on and off your lights based on dusk and dawn. So it will tell when the solar is no longer generating power, it must be night. So it'll turn on your lights. And then when you start generating power again, the sun must be up. It'll turn your lights off. So you can actually control um, how many hours a, a day or a night it's on. And you can also have it turn on multiple times. So say, have it turn on for two hours after dusk and then two, two hours before dawn. So it's a really nice controller that's both the charge controller and the lighting controller built into one. The Sun Saver Duo, this is a newer product. This is really nice if you've got a boat or an RV where you have two battery banks, say one for your cabin lights and one for your engine. So you can connect the same solar array to two different battery banks and it will control charging both of them. You can set different priorities so you can say you know what my cabin lights are more important I want all of the power to go to that once that's satisfied okay send it over some and charge up my engine battery or vice versa or you can divide it so that the power goes 50-50, 25-75 gives you a lot of flexibility of what your priority is and how you want to distribute the power that you're getting from that solar panel. It also has a very nice remote meter that you can use to configure all those, those settings and to see what the power being generated and the voltage of the, uh, the battery bank is. Gives you lots of diagnostic and error messages and very nice informational and because it's remote, you can, you can put it in your cabin away from the batteries so that you don't have to climb down to where your battery bank is to see what's going on with your batteries. Really, really nice feature. If you have any interest in any of our other charge controllers, pop on over and check out some of our other videos. Thanks for watching.